hello everyone, and here I'm with another or LEGO Star Wars review, but also my first LEGO Star Wars Fall 2019 set review, and my first LEGO Star Wars Rise of Skywalker set review. So, and we'll start it all off with the Resistance A-Wing Fighter. So, on the front of this box here, which has the quite cool new border, which is kind of similar to the white with Darth Vader border, but in black with minifig Kylo Ren, like how on other toys there is a regular Kylo Ren there, kind of cool. So, let's see, Lego logo, new Star Wars logo, Disney logo, and picture of the set in action, the two minifigs included, and... Recommended ages 7 plus, seven, set number 75248, has 269 pieces. And then flip to the back, see the A-Wing in a resting position and everything. Now to the Instagram booklet. On the front of the booklet. So it's the same picture as on the front of the box and everything. On the back, how to win on the online survey. All the pieces that are included in the set. After the uh, Star Wars Skywalker Saga game coming in 2020. After all the fall sets, which, which expect reviews on these other ones pretty soon. And then after all the minifigs included in each one. And after Lego Life and the last steps. So first of all, for the mini picks, first of all is Snap Wexley. Or yeah, Snap Wexley. We haven't seen it in any sets for quite some time, but the only other appearance we've ever had this character in was the uh, X-Wing Microfighter from 2016. So unlike if you were with someone who's not really there with the Microfighters, well, this is a good opportunity to get this one. But other than that, the uh, helmet print and torso prints and everything all quite the same. And same face print, everything. And then next of all is Lieutenant Connix, who was shown a bit in The Last Jedi, but as but now made in minifig form for this set. So there we go. See in his her torso print done quite good and the hair piece of which also done good and has some good back torso print but also a good double side face which I think might be the same as Ray's from earlier sets but not sure though but yeah and that's about it for both things and now on to the A wing fighter itself this so much a uh, kind of good A wing but you see it's Color scheme is mainly uh, green and white. And actually, haven't seen this color scheme on an A wing in like since like 2009 with the calm or calamari calamari cruiser. There's that kind of kind of what a coincidence. This for episode nine and that last time was 2009, but whatever. So the front part of it does have some good uh, angling to it, like so get a lot of stickers in this set. Same with these other Rise of Skywalker sets. And like the recent, like the last A-Wing, it does have the spring roller launchers and you can tap it, to tap it to do so on there. And the cockpit area, which does have some just a couple of stickers on it and just enough space to lift it up and and unlike the last A wing it just doesn't have any control paneling in it but however it does have enough space to fit a fig into it and close over and the gun air barrels of which are kind of similar to past A wings but do have that same piece there as well into the back tail areas which are built quite goodly like some good snot all around and and same fin piece same 
uh, wing pieces as the other ones, but the bottom ones of which are stickered, and of which are perfectly symmetric. And got the back engine also built quite goodly. And from the bottom is you yeah, have all the like landing gear that does fold up and hidden nice and snugly. And so as for comparison of the last A-Wing we've had since 2017, like I see kind of similar in color scheme, but like this more dark green, the last one was dark red. But in The Last Jedi, there was one that was in gray and blue. wonder why they didn't release that for this, but maybe time will tell. And let's from the sides. As you see, it always has some more greeble as well. The other one has more tiling to it. But also the gum barrel areas, also kind of similar to that. And on the back of it, same build, but just has a tile left to it. Probably to differentiate from Rebellion and Resistance. And also the top canopy areas, also a little bit different which has some tiles rather than some sloping and I guess that is about it Hang on. so now on to the final verdict so overall verdict on this set is which a pretty good set for fall ways and at least finally get Lieutenant Connix, who of which is actually really to Prince General Leia a bit. And also an, another time of getting Snap Wexley in a set. And at least do have some good white and green to it. So if you're like looking to start your collection of Rise of Skywalker, then go ahead and get this set. And if you're looking to continue your fleet of A-Wings. Also, go ahead and get this set. And that is it with this video, and thanks for watching.